how would I say this? I have a potential huge, bigger fight than him. So I might pin him off for the side. You know, I'm still going to fight him, but I have, I wouldn't, I wouldn't not fight him unless it was even a bigger opportunity, but I cannot say anything right now. So I'm just going to keep it at that. I feel like Ryan Garcia is kind of bluffing here because uh, he's probably just making Team Javonta nervous and saying, oh shit, we need to take the fight. Otherwise, Ryan's going to get, Ryan's going to take another fight. I feel like that's what Ryan's doing, but obviously I wouldn't rule it out because the only other bigger fight than the Javonta Davis fight is pretty much the Pacquiao fight, like in, in around uh, Ryan Garcia's weight. Like who else is there that's a bigger fight than Javonta Davis in an in a, in and around Javonta De- uh, Ryan Garcia's weight class? Like at lightweight, bigger than Javonta Davis fight for Ryan Garcia. Maybe Tia Fimo, but that fight ain't happening. Like Ryan Garcia's never mentioned his name, so it's not gonna be a random thing. And Tia Fimo's like the Cambosos fight is pretty much done. And is the Tia Fimo fight a bigger fight? Maybe in hardcore fans' perspective, maybe because it's all the belts. But the Giovanna, in terms of casual, the Giovanna Davis fight is definitely a lot bigger and. You're making more money and it's prob- stylistically an easier, f- I'm not saying it's an easy fight, but it's an easier fight than the TFM fight for Ryan. So yeah, I feel like m- I'm more in the side of Ryan Garcia's just trying to scare Javonta and Mayweather and Team Javonta to just take the fight. Because Javonta's been saying, no, oh, I'm the A-side, he needs to be 60-40. I feel like this is a, in a way... That Ryan's just trying to scare Javonta. Oh, if you don't fight me, I'll just fight someone else. I'm a big name. I'll just go and fight somewhere else. Someone else. So, yeah, because literally the only name that is literally bigger than Javonta's is Manny Pacquiao. Obviously, there's Errol Spence and stuff. But they're too big and that's too risky and early for Ryan right now. The, pa- the reason why Pacquiao is not a far-fetched fight is because... Pacquiao is in a stage where it looks like he's just going to have them one fight a year, one big fight a year. And Pacquiao's not a big auto. He can come down to 140 and Ryan can easily move to 140. So it's not, it won't really be two weight divisions. It'll be one because Pacquiao will come down and Ryan will go one up. So yeah, if, I feel like he's just trying to scare Javonta. But if he's not, then it can only be the money Pacquiao fight. And if that fight happens, then may God bless Ryan Garcia. So yeah, like, subscribe, comment down below if you lot genuinely believe that Ryan Garcia has another bigger fight than Javonta. Or is he just trying to catch Javonta out, scare him? So yeah, comment down below and comment down below if Ryan fights Pacquiao or Javonta, who you think is going to win. And yeah, peace.